Today, educators, civil rights activists, students speaking out against the Florida Board of Education's vote to ban critical race theory being taught in public school curriculum. Ahead in their next meeting in the two weeks, the, gov the group asked the governor to come meet with them to talk. Now, Leah Shields was at the rally this morning. She has more. Let the teachers teach the truth. Let the teachers teach the truth. Education the is the most powerful the weapon there is to change the world. The Northside Coalition, Take Em Down Jacks, and multiple other civil rights organizations came together to make their voices heard. Teach the truth in school. Ben Frazier says the controversy over critical race theory is about the state not wanting students to learn the truth about American history. So not to permit the teaching of critical race theory of what happened to indigenous people and black people, if that is removed from the curriculum, the students are learning that truth doesn't matter. I think that's a travesty. Teachers here say the state is trying to bully them into silence, and they say the ban is a slippery slope. This weekend, we are celebrating the 4th of July, and we're supposed to be celebrating liberty and justice for all. Yeah. We will not have that until we start extinguishing the lies and the omissions that have led us to where we are right now. Governor Ron DeSantis called critical race theory toxic and divisive, saying it forces students to think about their skin color rather than the content of their character and what they're trying to accomplish in life. This group strongly disagrees and is inviting the governor to sit down and talk with them. Leah Shields, First Coast News on your side.